Stockopedia provides a range of preset stock screens that are an absolute goldmine for investors looking for shares that fit their investment style. You'll find them under Browse. Click Browse, you'll be taken to the popular screens page, which shows you both the Stockopedia screens and the Guru screens. The Stockopedia screens are based on our own proprietary data like the stock ranks and different combinations of the quality, value and momentum rank, which you can browse at leisure. Also, we show some popular guru screens based on famous investment books. We have 65 models from famous books and academic research papers, which you can go and dig into to find shares that might match your interests. Before I look at one of the pages, see in the sidebar that we have the Stockopedia screens listed there. These are classifications which you can browse. You can click top stock ranks for quick access to the top stock rank screens and compare their performance since inception. You can look at the stock rank styles, which are, are different style classifications, for example, finding high flying growth shares, momentum traps, sucker stocks and more. The risk ratings, which are based on the volatility of the shares, where I think it's best to avoid highly speculative shares because they're very risky. The upgrades, which shows you quick access to new 90 plus stock rank shares, as you can see here, and also downgrades to find shares that are now at a very low ranking or poor styles. Underneath those, you'll find the guru screen classifications. You can find quality investing screens based on Buffett-esque stock screens, growth investing screens for those who like earnings growth, often based on forecasts, value investing screens for those trying to find cheaper shares, bargain stocks for the very extreme cheap shares in the market. These tend to be riskier strategies based on finding very, very deep value shares. Income screens for those looking for higher dividend yielding shares and momentum investing screens for those trying to find shares in uptrends. There's also a short selling classification, which in my opinion, again, are shares best avoided. Let's dive into one of the pages to show you the screening page. This is the Benjamin Graham Enterprising Investor screen. There'll also be a link through to read more from the book it's from, as well as a description and links to find out more about that stock screen. You'll also see the rules upon which it's based and the criteria used to create it. You'll find a performance history since we started tracking it in real time in quarterly rebalanced portfolios. And underneath, you'll find the results. This shows you the number of results and a table which shows you all the currently qualifying stocks for that screen with these nice popovers, as well as different columns based on the screen criteria. You do, of course, have access to your other tables as normal. You can, of course, copy any of these stock screens into your own saved screens. So just give it a different name and make a copy and then you will find it under screens in your screens. So you can save that for future reference. So it's a very good way if you want to adapt the rules and edit the rules, copy the screen and make it your own. I hope this gets you started in screening.